hey guys welcome back to the video i hope you all are doing great and i also hope that you have watched the previous video that is the chrome automation if not there's a link in the description as well as there's an i button top right here click that watch the video and then come right here and today's video is basically the windows automation as the title says and also in the previous video i had already mentioned now before moving into the uh, programming and stuff uh, i would like to mention that you know i've left the uh, source code of uh, virtual assistant chrome automation youtube automation google assistant uh, google automation and uh, all the automations uh, link source code link in the description make sure you go check that out uh, copy it paste it in your virtual assistant folder if you have not checked out the video on how to access the source code i'll do leave that link in the description as well as there's an i button top right here click that watch the video you know take the source code make your job easier now today's video is the windows automation we are almost coming to the end of the automation series uh, the next video is going to be the most awaited video in our channel yes you heard it right that is the home automation or the smart home automation many people requested for this video and it's going to come very soon so stay tuned for that make sure to subscribe and keep that notification on so whenever it comes you'll get to know come watch the video do the programming and make your home automation a smart home automation with your virtual assistant so today's video is the windows automation it's not that big as the google automation so it's just like the chrome uh, you know chrome automation video so yeah it's, it's it's a short one but it is necessary for the virtual assistant so without wasting more time let's get straight into the video guys so guys right here i am in my visual studio or oh, the virtual assistant file right here as you can see this is the chrome automation google automation youtube automation and then the virtual assistant so all these codes are oh, the source code is there in the description so go check it out as i said in the beginning so now let's do the uh, windows automation so first let me put here a uh, windows windows uh, automation yep so in windows first let's do the home screen so suppose you're asking the virtual assistant home screen so what you're going to do is first you're going to put lf and then you're going to put home screen home screen and then uh, what you're going to do is you're going to put in command okay and then you're going to click enter and then we are going to use the press and release now if you're not sure where we use this press and release you can see right here we use this even for the chrome automation too so what you're going to do right here is you're going to put windows okay windows it's a key okay it's, windows is basically a key windows and then what you're going to do is you're going to give space and put it as plus m okay so it is windows plus m and then you're going to click enter and we are going to use the play sound that is 9 uh, 9.mp3 if you have not downloaded the notification i've done a video i'll be the uh, i button top right here click that watch that also the all the notification link will be there in the description so check out the you know description first Every, all the links everything will be there in the description check it out download source code everything is there so just check it out so we are going to use the play sound this is basically like a notification after this what we're going to do is we're going to put the break function right so we're going to do this and to make a job easier what we're going to do is we're going to copy this so we're just going to say control c and what we're going to do is we next we're going to click enter and control v now instead of home screen now let's go to the next function so the next function what we're going to do is uh, minimizing the screen so i'll put minimize right here yeah so suppose you want to minimize the screen what are you going to do you're going to put uh, windows plus uh, we are going to put it as uh, press and release and we are going to put it as windows plus m okay so first of all if you want the screen to be minimized you can put windows plus m and to go to the home screen basically you're going to the home screen you you are again going to use windows plus m so we'll just keep it as it is and now we'll click enter now the next thing uh, what we're going to do is you're going to control v obviously 
and we are going to remove this home screen and put uh, the next thing the next function what we are going to use is to show uh, show start so uh, to that uh, what you're going to do is you're going to put show and then you're going to put it as start fine and then after this what you're going to do is you're going to put it as press uh, this time you're not going to use press and release we're just going to use as uh, this windows so we're going to just use press right here so i'll just remove this press and release and i'm going to use press so it's going to just going to press windows so that's done now next what you're going to do is you're going to click and again you're going to click uh, uh break and you're going to click enter now once this is done what you're going to do is you're going to click enter and then what you're going to do is you're going to put it as home uh, open settings so for that again what you're going to do is control v and after this what you're going to do is you're going to remove the home screen obviously and you're going to put it as open uh, settings so to do that what you're going to do is you're going to put it right here open settings and once this is done uh, what you're going to do uh, is uh, you're going to put windows and after windows you're going to put it as i fine now windows setting is done the next what we're going to do is again control v uh, now we're going to remove home screen obviously and once home screen is removed next we're going to use is open open search so you want to search right here this is the search button right here you want to search that so what you're going to do is open search and then what you're going to do is windows uh you're going to use as windows plus uh, s fine now windows uh, sorry uh, open search is done now what next suppose you want to take the screenshot what you're going to do is first let's put control v let's paste it right here and let's remove the home screen and put it as screen and we're going to put it as shot now for the screenshot we are going to use a different command or uh, we are going to put it as press uh, obviously press and release and then we are going to put it as shift capital uh, if you remember for the previous code also we uh, we had done this uh, the shift was capital and then again you're, what you are going to do is space and then plus and then s so that's screenshot guys so once this is done your screenshot is done so you can just say a virtual assistant take screenshot and it will take your screenshot and save it in your file so again what you're going to do is you're going to click enter and what we're going to do is this is the last command uh, last but not the least uh, that's going to be the restore restore window so we are, what we are going to do is we are going to put restore and after restore we are going to put it as windows and then what we're going to do is again oh that is uh, we are going to put shift and after shift we are going to give space and plus m not capital M, small m. So that's it was for the Chrome or sorry, the Windows automation. This was the whole code. If you want, I will leave the source code in the description. You can get it, copy it, paste it and make your job easier. So that's it for today's video, guys. I hope you understood what we did. Uh, well, uh, the next video is going to be, as I uh, told you in the beginning, that's going to be the smart home automation or the home automation. So stay tuned for that. Like the video, subscribe the channel and share to the friends and any people who are interested in all the automation windows automation chrome automation all the automation series it's there check out the description that's it guys i hope you enjoyed the video and understood the video uh, till then happy coding and bye guys peace out